Okay, today we're going to learn how to hyperlink objects within a smart notebook so that you can set up an interactive uh, lesson for your students. You can see on the left hand side column I have a uh, preloaded lesson which I've made. Um, I've dragged and dropped all of this. I'm just going to show you how to actually hyperlink objects so you can get from one page to the other. So you can see that on this slide we have an activity for your students. They're pretty much going to roll this die. Um, whoever gets the higher, student one or student two, will pick a question. Um, you can have multiple questions. We only have three here, um, but one, two, and three questions. Whoever rolls a higher number will choose question one. Um, and then if they get that right, they'll tally it under um, student one or student two, uh, whatever student they are. But how are they actually going to get to these questions? We're actually going to have to hyperlink these black dots um, to the corresponding pages. So we're going to right click on the dot. We're going to go to link. And you can see on this left hand column it has web page, page in this file, uh, file on this computer, um, or current attachments. If you can hyper to, hyperlink it to an actual web page, um, you can do that. If there's maybe an uh, interact quiz um, on another web page that's pre made. But we're going to um, hyperlink it to a page in this file. Um, so if we look down here, we can actually see, once we click on slide 11, we can see the previews um, of those slides. Slide 12, is this, we're not going to hyperlink it back to the same slide. We're going to hyperlink it to the next slide. That's um, our first question, our question 1, and we're going to hyperlink it. That's slide 13. And we're going to hit OK. And you can see in the bottom left-hand corner um, that the uh, this little box, hyperlink box, shows up. That's how we'll navigate it um, when we're not in preview mode. When we are in preview mode and when it's actually up on our smart board, we can click on that black circle and it will take us to that question. Um, but while we're in uh, this uh, creating mode where we're actually creating uh, this smart board document that we're going to just use this little box to navigate our way through and it will show us that that hyperlink is actually applied to that object. So we're going to do the same thing for number two, except we're not going to, we're going to click link, but we're going to hyperlink it not to 13, but we're going to hyperlink it to slide 14. And you can see that hyperlink symbol showed up in the bottom left hand corner as well. And we're going to hyperlink this question three to a page in this document. And we're going to go to 15. And now we can see that um, our three questions are hyperlinked to slides 13, slides 14, and slides 15. So let's go to slide 13. So if they want to answer question one, they'll click that hyperlink symbol in the bottom left hand corner. And it will take them to the question. They'll answer the question. Um, there's a couple manipulatives that they can use. Uh, they can drag. We've made these um, infinitely cloned so they can actually um, use manipulatives to answer their uh, problem. And then I have this go back, which I've already inserted as a text, but we're going to have to insert a back arrow. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to go up to shapes. We're going to have our drop down menu. We're going to grab this arrow. We're going to draw it. We need to be able to navigate back. And we're going to make sure we have our icon, our mouse icon selected so that we can maybe turn it looks like it's going backwards, so we can go back to that question. Uh, but we're going to have to hyperlink this object now back to our original slide so that the students can then navigate uh, to uh, more questions. So we're just going to link it, same as we did before, but we're going to go to a page in this file, and we're going to link it back to page 12, back to our uh, tally sheet and our die and our questions. And we're going to hit OK, and now we can see that the uh, Hyperlink is actually in the bottom right hand corner, that symbol. We're going to click it, and now it takes us back um, to our original instructions and that original page on that platform for this whole activity. Um, and that is how you hyperlink um, two different pages and hyperlink objects uh, within Smart Notebook. Good luck.